The Multidisciplinary Comprehensive Assessment Team, or MCAT, is an effort to intervene early and help keep youth in their homes and communities. Local teams can collaborate with clinical experts from multiple disciplines to address challenging situations. Um, when I first met the family, it was at a tough time. Uh, they were having a lot of unpredictable aggression issues, not necessarily understanding what was driving some of those forces and issues and struggles. And they were at a point where they had trialed so many things over the years that they weren't sure what was going to work. And, and they were honestly questioning their ability to maintain his support in the home. We've had Nathan since birth and um, involved in a lot of programs. And this is the first program along with the recommendations that gave us a lot of hope and things that were realistic for us to do as well as to apply to Nathan so that it was working in our household. Breathe in, go to the next one, breathe out. Good job, in. I think the biggest concern was that safety piece, you know, safety for themselves when there was physical aggression involved in the family um, from Nathan's and some of his responses, um, but also for his, his quality of life, both here at home as well as in school and in the community. And um, those concerns kind of are what set the tone of where our focus was going to be around building on safety and safety skills and independence. and. Um, how to better communicate your needs to others. And, and that was really where I think on day one, our focus started. How do we stay safe? By listening. By what? Listening. Okay. And how do we help mom and dad stay safe? No hitting, no kicking. No hitting and no kicking. Good job. This program really helped because it bridged so many of the glaring gaps of what was going on and didn't just give a name or a title to something but just kind of very multifaceted and dealing with specifics to do with behavior his ability to understand and function and then to empower us to deal with him effectively yeah and what i kind of got out of it when uh, steve would explain we would uh, tell him about our problems and what he was doing versus what we were doing and you would go, oh, that's classic. And then you'd kind of explain that to us, which made sense. For that, we weren't thinking that way. So that was a great help. You want to tell them what this one is? Pretzel. The pretzel breathing. And what do we do? If it kind of makes sense to you and you're willing to commit, this is the first thing that we've ever done or experienced that there was hope and that you can't say 100% it works because it's an ongoing thing, but there's so many positives to it. Yeah. And that if something's not working, you got somebody to fall back on and to help you to go to the next level or to talk to somebody else, but to get some answers for you. If you are interested in youth technical assistance, head to dodd.ohio.gov and click on the regional teams icon. You can use the interactive map to find contact information for the Multi-System Youth Regional Liaison for your county.